I also like to do with um, these very shimmery colors. So I like to add a little bit of white into it. Just to make it a little bit more solid. So here I've got my white gel. Just make sure your tool is completely clean. By adding a little bit of white to this color, you actually lighten it. If I paint it, you can actually, you don't really see much of a difference. It just definitely brings that pink out a little bit more. Okay. Now let's see what else we can do with this pink. It's going to add a little bit of gel in here. I'm still keeping in mind my ratio. I'm adding a little bit of burgundy, burgundy metallic into this. So meaning you would be able to mix one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, it doesn't really matter. As much as you possibly want colors together to get the desired effect. I wouldn't go too crazy because one or two normally gives you the desired effect. But just look at how that color now has changed. And then we've got these fabulous neon colors that glow in UV. Just look at that. Oh. When I do this, just remember always to add more gel. If there's too much pigment in the gel, just add more gel. If there's too little pigment in the gel, just add more pigment. If it's not curing, if your gel's not curing, you've got too much pigment. So you could even mix the neon colors into our regular colors and oh my soul, it's just so divine. Wow. Hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for listening and subscribe to our channel. Thanks. Bye.